Kew Theatre. We're keeping it fresh with Manawa Hine, so follow me. This is a story inspired by artistic director Tai Royal, a story that was told to him from Te Arawa, um, the story about Te Ao Kapurangi and how she basically saved her people from annihilation. We basically had a jam. So we got in the studio, um, everyone sort of used the essence of what the story was about and just moved that through the body. And um, this is what we've created. This is why I love New Zealand dancing, is because it has mana. That's the reason, there's a sense of family, there's a sense of togetherness, and mana wahine is incorporating um, so many different people's stories, and, it, and we're bringing it to life. I've kind of learnt my uh, Māori tanga um, through dance. Like I was, I grew up in Tamaki, so kind of away from my tribal affiliations, and I've learnt um, a lot about my culture through contemporary dance. So um, it's been an amazing experience. I always like to think of different people throughout the show. I often think of my mother but also these beautiful dancers that I get to dance with every day and get inspiration from them. It's quite rare in the dance industry in New Zealand to have um, a cast of women of five. We're all at a very experienced level in the contemporary world. Um, it's really, um, I don't know, it makes a difference. <laughs> like it just, you, you, can, you can feel that and um, I think that's something to acknowledge. were some really powerful moments. I enjoyed it thoroughly and the girls were amazing. Uh, the music was fantastic. The projections were, it was really beautiful, beautiful experience. Gave me goosebumps. I was crying continuously, tearing up every single time. It's a big story, but what we do in the show is that we take the essence of not only that story, but um, also what mana wahine is to us.